Scorpion. A pioneer ahead its time. Introduced by the Terran hegemony in 2570, the Scorpion is an example of a good idea that comes too soon, centuries before the technological renaissance which had a more open acceptance to new designs. Many shunned the mech due to the rough ride of the four-legged gate, a problem that would only be softened when the long-forgotten blueprints and prototypes of her lamb attempt were found in 3065, and the redesigned leg system was applied into new versions. Criticized by the lack of jump jets used on most medium mechs, her 97 km per hour top speed attenuate any maneuverability concerns a pilot may have. Despite being relegated to infantry support, she was originally intended as a stable weapons platform. If looked through an objective standpoint, the Scorpion is very capable in its intended role, allowing precise long-ranged fire with her body-mounted Anderson Armaments PPC. And if anything gets too close, a Marvel 6 load SRM-6 is just beside the cockpit. It is speculated that the purely cosmetic swivel mount smaller tube beneath the cockpit was intended for a flamer, machine gun, or a small laser that was dropped after the frame was completed, but the construction was kept to avoid slowing down production. Most of the variants change the engine for a light or an extra light one, and all the variants of PPCs are employed. Exception be made by the 12S, which uses a LB-10X instead, and the 1N from her notable pilot, Wendell Puritan, which goes with a large laser and more armor. The SRM may be swapped by a LRM-10, NARC, or MML-9. Some make use of the C3 technology. Subscribe for more videos like this. Bye for now.